What's up Airsofters? In this video, we're checking out the all new Specna Arms Edge 2.0 J series of AEGs. But first. Okay, first things first, if you're unfamiliar with Specna Arms, they're an incredibly well-known brand at this point for producing extremely high quality, feature-rich AEGs at very competitive price points. Their designs are well thought out, their material choices are robust without being overly heavy, and they've got a wide selection of models and furniture options on all of their platforms to fit every airsofter's needs and aesthetics. Now talking specifically about these Specna Arms J-Series Edge 2.0 AEGs I have in front of me, they're very clearly AK models. And they're currently available in two options, the AK-105 and the longer AKS-74. Now the future may see more models added to this Edge 2.0 J-Series, but currently at the time of this filming, these are the two available options. Now both feature full metal steel receivers and outer barrel assemblies, a removable steel dust cover under which is the battery storage space and wiring for your battery. The wiring is terminated to a Deans, as all things should be. You might also call it an Airsoft T-plug, but we both know what we're talking about. And thanks to the inclusion of a pre-installed gate Aster, tons of performance, but more on that a little bit later. On the left side of the receiver is an AK SVD style dovetail side mount for optics. Though you can of course forego an optic and use the standard AK leaf sight up front, uh, just in front of the dust cover. On the right side is an AK standard select fire switch. The magazine release is also in the standard location for an AK platform, just ahead of the trigger guard. Both the AK-105 and the AKS-74 have different barrel lengths, and I'm happy to see the correct use uh, of the gas block. The front sight post and muzzle device featured on each of the respective models. It's these attentions to detail that are easily missed by more affordable options, and they stand out to the discerning eye, which really, to me, bumps up the quality, once again, of these AEGs specifically. Now out back, we've also got two different stock options, with the 105 coming with the polymer folding stock and the AKS-74 coming with the skeletonized metal folding stock. I think they both look really cool and both utilize the kind of the folding stock AK pattern receiver. Finishing out the furniture of both of these models is a polymer standard issue style handguard and an AKM slash AK-74 motor grip or pistol grip. To the range! Out at the range, our FPS test showed the AK-105 and AKS-74 showed an average of just about 360 FPS and about 16 rounds per second on full auto. Swapping to the included M90 spring lowers your FPS to within most indoor field limits to about 320 FPS. Both lengths were tested using 0.20 gram BBs and an 11.1 volt, 1200-ish uh, volt lithium polymer battery, whatever will fit in the top of that battery storage compartment. In our distance and accuracy test, the target was no issue for either of these Specna Arms J-Series AEGs, with both versions placing a nice tight grouping on our 50-foot target. Out at the 100-foot mark, they both landed an equally nice grouping of shots as well. A precision 6.03 millimeter inner barrel is included from the factory, as well as an AK sliding style hop-up unit that's easy to adjust, but really nicely holds in place when you're done making that adjustment. It's not gonna vibrate out of adjustment you know, thanks to the, the you know, the, the vibrations of the fire of the gearbox. But if you're looking to do further upgrades to get a little bit more accuracy at distance, these AEGs are compatible with st standard AK hop-up units, buckings, nubs, all of which are available on our website at evic.com. 
At this point, we tested for mag fitment and compatibility. Here's what we found. We're happy to report that the AK-105 and AKS-74 were compatible with just about every magazine we threw at them, with fitment and feeding being consistent throughout. It's important to note that these Specna Arms J-Series AEGs are part of the new Edge 2.0 lineup, and as such feature some pretty trick internal upgrades. These AEGs feature the Orion 7mm version 3 gearbox. This reinforced gearbox shell comes pre-installed with steel gears and a sector delayer clip spun by a short-type high-torque motor with an O-type pinion gear. The compression system consists of a reinforced piston with a full rack of steel teeth with the second tooth removed for AOE correction, and an aluminum piston head with large ports. These components are paired with a non-ported cylinder, aluminum cylinder head, and an aluminum nozzle with an internal O-ring for better air seal. The spring guide is part of Specna's ESA2, or Easy Spring Access System, which can be easily accessed without having to remove the gearbox from the receiver, and allows for easy spring swaps in a matter of minutes. All you need to do is fold or remove the stock and remove the dust cover to access, then remove the spring and plate covering the spring guide using a screwdriver giving you access to the spring guide itself, which can be removed using a 6mm hex key to slightly push in and rotate the spring guide. These J-Series AEGs feature a pre-installed Gate Aster MOSFET system, again, because they're Edge 2.0s. This Aster is equipped with innovative optical sensors and a smart fuse that protects the battery, motor, and controller. It's got a ton of customizable functions and trigger settings and sensitivities, making for an excellent level of performance right out of the box. So, if you're looking to add a high-quality, feature-rich AK platform that comes in at a very competitive price point to your Airsoft collection, these Specna Arms Edge 2.0 J-Series AEGs are just what the Airsoft doctor ordered. You can find these AEGs and everything else to upgrade your Airsoft game right here at evic.com. Thanks for watching.